So hey, as I'm back, I'm just going to be doing a little update on everything. It's been a while since I posted, I think. I don't remember last time I posted, but we ended up, it's April, like mid-April, and we had a foot of snow on the ground. It's starting to melt. Well, it's been melting now. It's about all gone, but we had about a foot of snow on the ground in April. It's not April showers bring me flowers anymore. It's April snow bring May flows because freaking flooded floods. But... But the trailer is pretty much good to go. I just got to get cable ties, zip ties, whatever you want to call them. Zip tie all the wiring up because it's hanging down. I got to test it, make sure it works. And then should be good to go. I'm not doing the sides yet. I'll just have to strap everything down good um, because I don't have the money for the sides right now. This is not my mower. It's a friend's mower I'm working on. It runs. I got to do a clutch on it. And I gotta, It's going to take me a while. This seems complicated, that's for sure. But there's no clutch in it. There's just nothing there. So I gotta work on that. Um, this tire goes flat, but that'll be fine for him. This is just a bunch of crap. Still a tube out of that wheelbarrow, but it just didn't really end up working. <laughs> but that's old Betsy. She just needs a motor, pretty much, and I gotta do a bunch of welding, and then she'll be good to go, hopefully. This. Yeah. <laughs> That's not bearings. That's the centers falling out. I tried welding this one up, but I'm welding off the lead cord and it sucks. I'm not trying to say I'm good at welding. It's just being bad. It's me saying that I'm neither good at welding and my electricity sucks for welding. So yeah, the sled's going to be getting worked on. I got to pull the clutch this week sometime before I go back to my dad's and bring that over. The shop is about the same, I think. Um... An old girl, she does have a motor in her. Do a little cold start. No choke. And push in the clutch. Hold on. flathead that's nice pulley swapped still have a bigger pulley on the front i ended up i got my steering back now full steering um don't mind the welds but they seem to be holding took an old concrete anchor took the little end off welded it to the end of the original steering arm and just ran left the bolts loose but I put two on for it don't come loose and tighten this this up this. Um, this just gotta get rid of oil but this is about the same I'd say I think um, I had to put a ratchet strap on it because it was falling forwards but she meant um, that's some new toys not really new I've had them they're just at my dad's the impact, my big impact, which ain't staying here, that'll be at my dad's again, but I need it to do my clutch. Bunch of batteries, that battery's no good, but those two, we got five, I think, all together that are good. Um, even though this one's about shot, too, I think, because it don't really do much. But, and I got these, which is really nice, makes life a lot easier. Um, I'm actually cleaning up my shop right now. Organized up there because that was a mess. Um, I don't really have a video to do. Um, I gotta do some work maintenance to my shop. I gotta re-tarp all my walls or put plywood up, but they're probably just gonna be tarped again. As you can see, there's holes everywhere on these tarps. These tarps are old, been up for a long time, been used on. I don't know, probably about two dozen different occasions. <laughs> but yeah, I think that's about it. Everything's about the same, so yeah, peace.